Do you want to inject your own blood into your face to look hotter or maybe grosser? Because now you can. Hey gang, a very weirded out trace here for D News. Somehow famous queen of pop culture television Kim Kardashian has done it. She got the science community to talk about her. Well done, Kimberly. We're talking about her face and how bloody, bloody it is. Last week, Kim tweeted a picture of her face covered in a mysterious red substance and hashtagged it vampire facial. Wait, is that blood? The pop star got a blood facial on her show allegedly to keep her face looking younger. But is that really what she's doing, really? That crap doesn't really work. Or maybe it does. The vampire facial or blood facial is a bit of a misnomer. It's been around for a while. How it works is this. You go to the doctor, in this case a plastic surgeon, and you get your blood drawn. The blood is taken to a centrifuge and spun, which separates the plasma from the rest of the junk in there. I kind of think of it like cereal. The spinning separates the milk from the crunchy marshmallowy bits and everything else. In this case, we're just interested in the milk or plasma. Inside the plasma are these little things called platelets. After the spinning, the doctors take platelet-rich plasma, or PRP, and use small little acupuncture needles to inject it back into your face. Doctors at the National Institutes of Health did a study with platelet-rich plasma and determined that it does have the potential to heal wounds. And if you look at the signs of aging as wounds, maybe this could... No, more research is needed. Platelets are sticky little things that begin the clotting process. They gather around a wound and then break apart when exposed to the air. Once they're broken, they begin to form little fibers, and those fibers eventually become a scab. But there are some studies to suggest that growth factors in the plasma can be injected into wounds, in this case wrinkles, to help them heal. Now whether they heal the natural signs of aging, uh, I, I don't know. According to doctors who perform this procedure, acupuncture needles get the plasma into position to potentially encourage collagen growth. Collagen is what keeps our faces so young and springy. To be clear, we're not saying that this works. In fact, any evidence that it does is mainly anecdotal but it's not so totally insane. I don't I, my whole world is upside down. Right after her procedure, Kim asked her sister Courtney if her skin looked better and she was all like, no. Either way, gross, yuck, and I am out. What other crazy medical procedures have you heard of to reduce the signs of aging? Share them with us in the comments and remember to subscribe because we do two videos a day, seven days a week. Also remember to like D News on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, circle us on Google+. We are out there, come find us. Thanks for tuning in, see you later.